Hello and welcome at the series about Sacro Basics. In this video we are going to look at how to add personalization to a page. So to add personalization to a page it's the best way to open the experience editor and do it from there. So I have my home page opened here and what I'm about to do is personalize, personalize the content of this component based on certain criteria. So what I would like to do is configure that if someone has visited page one, I would like to show some other content. So I'm selecting, as you can see, the uh, component here, and then you will have a little icon here with some people that says create or edit personalization for this component. So I click it with my left mouse, and you will see the following screen. Um, you can personalize the presentation of the component to get started with, but what you need to do is select another component. So um, that's not something that we want right now. We only want to personalize the content, so we'll leave it default. Um, and this is the default state. Nothing happens here, it's just showing my content, but I can add uh, a second row, and I can specify a name for it, visit it, page one and I can select a rule, a condition uh, which should evaluate the true um, to make sure that different content is showed. So what I can do here is look for page and look for where the specific page has been visited during the current visit. It's the one that I want. So I can click on the specific title text and I can search for my page one. It's here, select OK. Now it says where the page one page has been visited during the current visit. Hit OK. And now I can specify what content I would like to show here. So I'm selecting this button and I have a promo personalized data source item here. This contains my content, my personalized content, and I'm clicking OK. Now it's good to remember that if you add more conditions like this, they are evaluated top down. So Sidecore is looking for the first one. It's going to check if the condition is true or not. If it's true, it's showing this content and the rest will, be, uh, uh, will not be uh, looked at. If the condition is false, it will go to the next one. If it's false, it will go to the next one, etc., etc. So I'm going to remove this one, click OK. And now I have a personalization rule on my homepage for my promo component. And you can see here that I see a 2-2. So I can uh, loop through it right now to see the differences. So default is this one and visited page one shows this one. So the only thing you need to do is save and publish and your personalization is alive.